significance only 40 hello to you wherever you happen to be our action comes to you today from villa park i'm your match commentator derek ray and ready to provide expert analysis alongside me is stuart robson only four teams are left in this cup competition we're at the semi-final stage and this is the first leg it's aston villa taking on chelsea this should be a great tactical battle which team is going to have the courage to try and win the game and which team will be fearful of losing the game plan of each coach will certainly be key today, Derek. Here's how the lineup looks for Aston Villa. Well, it's a 4 3 3 formation with a centre forward and two wingers. So it's important that the midfield players give support to the striker whenever the ball goes wide. They can't allow him to be isolated. Oh, this is looking promising. Chance here. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Well, a short corner here. And getting across to stop it. They favoured a short one here. The chance might be on for him. Now just the tackle that was needed. Well, it's a team full of stars and you never quite know who's going to pop up and shine. Perhaps, Stuart, it'll be Raheem Sterling today. Well, Derek, what confidence he's playing with at the moment. Second top scorer in the competition, and I expect him to have more impact again today. Here's the lineup for Chelsea. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. Palmer. Broya. Free kick to Chelsea. Well, making considerable progress with the ball. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. And in with a real chance. Can he find the net? Goalkeeping of the highest order. Well, he's got to be pleased with that save. It's absolutely magnificent. Shot attempted. Well, he'd be disappointed if he didn't take that one cleanly. Palmer. And they keep the ball. Advantage Chelsea. It needs an accurate cross. Half-hearted clearance. It's there for him. And there it is! The first goal in the semi-final. A huge moment. Extraordinary scenes. Alex Moreno. Here's Bailey. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Madueke. James. No degree of difficulty at all for the keeper. Nicolo Zaniolo. And space to exploit, maybe. And let's give credit to the defending. Palmer with it. Now breaking at pace. Potential danger. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Bailey. On the ball, Zaniolo. Patience and persistence on the passing front in the name of finding an equaliser. Oh, a save right out of the top drawer. Superstop. The first half. He... Now they get the ball rolling once more. Chelsea in front, but there might still be a few twists and turns before this is over.
Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Isaac. Isaac. Oh, big opportunity. And a goal to level this contest. All even. So underway again here on the back of that leveller. Rather than a free kick, it's advantage Chelsea. And a lot to like about this attack. In by Sterling. And problem solved for now. Isaac. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Well, we wondered if this deal was going to be done. In fact, it has now been done, Stuart. Well, he's certainly got ability. A lot of clubs have been in for him, but now he needs to fulfil that potential. He might just have to be patient, though. And they're not standing off their opponents in the slightest. And into the last 30 minutes now. A very effective challenge put in. Diaby. Musa Diaby. Here's Isaac. My goodness, it looked as though he was clean through. And the referee, what will he do here? Diaby. And there to intervene. And don't forget, we have more Premier League action coming up for you on EA TV. It's Aston Villa facing Everton. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. And Chelsea get the decision from the referee. And a substitution in the offing. Oh, well, you can't get them right every time. And he got that one very wrong. Yeah, it's a poor free kick, I have to say. What was he thinking? He was never going to score from there. Isaac. And in the perfect position to read it. Madueke. And they keep the ball. Advantage Chelsea. 15 minutes left for play. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Isaac. No well, space for them here. Isaac. And he's made it a brace for himself. The defender is just unable to stay with him. And he's having a field day. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? And in with a real chance. It could be up for grabs. It was an attack of promise, but they couldn't take advantage of the situation. Nkunku, intense pressure. Good work from Villa to win it back. Isaac, can he finish them off? He's done it! What a climax to this game! So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. Axel Di Sassi. Armando Broya. And Sterling has it. Really poor timing, and some will argue that he was asking for a yellow card. Played in there. It's still alive, not finished yet, not quite yet. 
Still excitement left in the game. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. The defenders know you can't really allow space like that. Oh, what an opportunity. And a goal! They lead by two now. And that allows them to breathe a bit more easily. And there it is, the referee blows for full time. And my goodness, no wonder these home fans are ecstatic. Still, there is a job to do, but they must fancy their chances based on this performance. Well, it was a great performance, wasn't it? You could see the game...